okay? I've like never, literally never done a video like this before. We're doing my character, we're doing X character, which is every rank. So I'm gonna make this like a like little mini series that I do every so often. Uh, I just find the people on Twitch and just play every rank. See if I can beat every single rank, including Valhalla. I might add like a pro at the end. Like imagine if I did every rank Valhalla and then like did like a pro like I play Snowy or something with the character. But yeah, uh, so the goal is that it's not a crew battle. I'm just gonna 1v1 all the ranks and see like gradually how much better each uh, each rank gets versus the character I'm playing. But yeah, we're gonna start with bronze and then we're gonna work our way up all the way to Valhalla. And uh, yeah, let's just, let's, uh, let's just see how this goes. I've never done something like this before, so it's gonna be fun. Make sure you like and subscribe to the video, all that good stuff. And you can just like skip around. Maybe I'll like section out each rank and shit. But yeah, we're gonna get started. This guy says he's bronze. I mean, he has the pupil title. I didn't even know this was a title. Level 5 base Jala and no avatar. So it actually might be a bronze player. And uh, I did this out of order. So I played the silver player first. And that guy did 23 damage. So that guy was also playing Vector though. Maybe that character's hard. So let's see. This guy, yo, you can just ban, like, just go click the map you want to go to. Or you can buy one by one, that works too. This guy might do better, maybe. I'm actually worried he might. I tried to read him. I don't know why I tried to read him. I don't know why I tried to read him. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I tried to do a dodge read and then I remembered from the last game that these guys just won't be dodging. I mean, this guy's already done more damage than the other guy. But he also just doesn't dodge. Does, okay, this guy's scarier because he not only does he not dodge, but he also doesn't recovery. So, like, do you, when you're playing, do you just like go off stage and then die? Because that that explains a lot. I mean, this guy unironically did more damage than the last guy, but I'm, this guy, wait, this guy doesn't have recovery bounded. I don't think he knows all the moves, bro. This guy. I mean, my chat, my comments are gonna be like, "Why are you flaming bronze players when you're Valhalla and they're bronze?" I'm not even flaming it. I'm just, I'm being like genuinely honest. This guy doesn't press recovery when he's off stage to get back to the map, bro. You have to recover. You have to, right? All right. This guy says he's silver, so I'll let him pick map and everything. You guys can pick map. Go whatever map you want. This guy's silver. Is it okay that I'm AEU? I'm just playing NA for now. Okay, so I'm assuming he just doesn't dodge, and that's why he's silver. So I can just like piece him up like this over and over again. For the most part, you just kind of know why someone is the rank they are. Yep. This is loud. Have I gotten hit yet? Surely we dodge, right? Is this what they're doing in silver? I mean, this guy... Okay, so if you're, like, watching this and you're silver as well and you want to learn, like, the first step is, like, you have to dodge, obviously, right? Like, you can't just, like, get hit by scythe strings, like, non-stop. Battle cover. <laughs> Oops, put it jump. Alright, that's one rank down. Uh, dude, <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's what silver players look like. I can't even be mad, 23 damage is not bad. This guy needs to bind his dodge key and then we can start from there. Alright, this is a gold Asuri player. He's doing the, he's doing the wrenched sandstorm cosplay with the Asuri versus Mordex. This guy's gold. And uh, you can pick him up. So, so silver player didn't dodge. Bronze player just didn't have recovery bounded. Oh yeah, that's a gold border. So silver player didn't dodge. Bronze player just didn't have recovery bounded. Uh, let's see. Let's see. What, it's a lonely world when I represent the tin population. Actually, truth. There's more. There's more uh, Valhalla players. All right. So this guy is gold. Let's see what his problem is. Let's see if we can fix all you guys' problems. So he does dodge, but. It's uh, not like a good dodge, I guess. And then he, he also recovers really fast. 
Like he he rushes his recovery. Should have killed him. Yeah. So this is the reason honestly, like I'll say okay, you guys are gonna clown me for this. But the bronze player is harder to play because he literally like you can't tell what he's doing and he just doesn't like press some of his keys. Gold players are like they they have like some understanding of what they're supposed to be doing, so it becomes slightly easier to read them. But like, this, uh, but they also like rush and they like miss space stuff. Like this guy, uh, he he like knows how to like recovery and stuff and where he's supposed to like be trying to go. Except he just like rushes it and will end up misplacing the move and he'll just like get punished like that. Surely, right? Oh. I mean, I can say one thing about this player. He has drip. He's using the best of Surrey skin. He's using a fire color. Wait, he's different. All right, surely I like, close this off now, right? Surely I like, close this off now, right? Okay, so that guy was gold. I think I talked about why he failed to defeat me while the game was going on. All right, let's see if we can get a plat player. This guy, yeah, this guy is giving very much console. I'll assume he's plat though, cause he he just he swapped. <laughs> the reason the reason it's so funny to me that he swapped to a plat avatar is because you get every avatar. Like I could t I can swap to a plat avatar too, bro. You're not you're not fooling anyone. All right, let's get in the game with them and see what's up. Player like skill wise, so it could definitely be like like whatever like point of diamond I pick could completely be different than the last one so I'm not gonna question him too much. This guy this guy is different from the rest of them. You can tell. You can tell this guy's different. He's locked in my one true weakness. He he's plat because he already he already com comprehends the the skill value in counter picking. Does the correct combo as well. Oh, but he weapon too much. Wait, no. Oh, okay, he yeah, just killed me. Do you think he knows he could have killed me? That's disappointing. That's truly disappointing. I'm diamond. Yeah, there's probably a bunch of diamond players in my chat. Diamond is like when you're diamond is probably like when you watch like streams the most and shit. I feel like am I wrong? I didn't like start watching Brawlhalla on Twitch till I was diamond. What rank did you guys start watching Brawlhalla at? Like just like I mean, obviously it has to be like somewhat low because I have a bunch of people that are not diamond in my chat. But I didn't like start getting into shit majorly till I was diamond. I just like focus on playing for the most part. I like him. He has potential. He has potential. All he needs now is my coaching. Oh no. Am I the only one that hates New Gauntlet there? I don't like that I sent straight up. It feels hard. I mean, I guess the point is that it's hard to follow up, but it's also just like less fun to play. I don't know. Like when I hit there, it doesn't feel as it doesn't feel as like fun and rewarding. I guess that's the nerf, but like it's less fun, you know. I'm trying to have fun. I mean, one stock, one stock. I can get away with losing. If I lose two, I might there might be uh, some questions erupting about my talent. So, I'll just take him out there. 
feels weird now. Yeah. All right, that guy was plat. I mean, for the most part, yeah. The, you can like see the skill go up as the the games go on. All right, this guy is 2100. Uh, you can already tell I'm getting into the scary elos because he's rocking his like di <laughs> he's rocking his diamond avi. He has his macho man locked in. So, we're, yeah, we're getting into that territory of like real diamond generals, bro. Straight to brawl haven. This guy's getting feisty. Alright, so I think the hardest part is going to be looking for that Valhalla player. We need to find someone that's Valhalla. Okay, let's see, let's see what we have to do for here. This guy is more patient than the rest of them, but he also plays all of them, so he just have to be. I was adjusting my ear airpod, bro. It's all good. Nice little aggression from me there. Can I play if I'm 2300? Uh, this guy's 2100, and then I'm looking for someone that got Valhalla. So you can, you can probably get the next one though. The next time I do one of these, based on how this video does. So don't let this video fail. Oh no. Like rushing his input seems to calm down. That was bad spacing for me. I knew he was gonna do that there too. That actually KO'd him. I didn't I actually didn't think that would KO. Him. I really missed that down. Down. I'm shit. Damn, 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 damn. No one you know is Valhalla right now? Yeah, I'm talking about last season. Because season just reset. Interesting. Finding KOs on Gauntlets have become so complicated, bruh. You just like fish for recovery nowadays. It's a new season? Yeah, season reset like a couple days ago. Alright, that guy was 2100. I feel like at that point it became easier the higher you went up. Oh, we found the we found the Valhalla level player. I didn't even have to go search for him, he came to me. Alright. We found our Valhalla challenger. We took a bit to find him because we we had a lot of people that were 2400. I have like a couple of people in the lobby that are 2400, but they're not Valhalla. They're just 2400. So I want to get like I want to confirm 20 2500 Valhalla status. And of course, it's the guy coming in here with the level 100 Taros, bro. Val I keep telling you guys, Valhalla players are shameless. They are sh they'll do anything to secure their victory. It's fine though. Do you want to play Taros or Jala? He's lo he's lovering Taros. So I'm I'm ready to start this. I'm ready to start this. Like pressure. This is basically a rank game, bro. I fucking hate. Uh, Axe so much and how it jumps over moves. So disgusting. Wait, he's different. 
Wait, he's actually different. Okay. I have to stay forward. Holy shameless. Scrap the video? Bro, you can't scrap the video. The entire point is that you lose at the end, no? Alright, this guy locked in drip. W content, we lose these? Bro, I was not expecting him to come so hard, bro. We have to focus up. It's go time. Pause? Yeah, pause. What's the room code? Doesn't matter. Time to focus up? Actually, though. What would Meggy do to beat this guy? Should you even count Taros players as, as Valhalla players, bro? They're playing a different game. Like, have you seen? Have you seen how Luna looks playing Taros compared to every other character? It's li it's literally a different game. I didn't think you'd go for that, sir. All right. Putting 50 hours on Terrace is actually crazy to me. I knew he was going to do that Sarah because I had no dodge, so he thinks I'm going to jump since I have no dodge. But I didn't know how to punish it on Gauntlets, which is why I don't play Mordex. Any other weapon I punish that on? Second is GG's. Bro, it's heading losable. It's never losable, guys. You always have to focus. Mm -hmm. That's how we do it, Remy? Yeah, I just have to focus up there. Alright, he's on his fin for the last game. This is how hard it is. I mean, honestly, what it, all this says is that game three, game three is like when you focus up. Like, if I played this guy in tournament, he'd get the upper hand at the start, and then game three is when you focus up and bring it together. Surely, right? So let's let's bring it together here for this game three. Pressure. He's like playing for one hits. No wonder he plays Terrace. Like, gen like he genuinely applies like no pressure. Is he running? It's hard sometimes, bro. It's hard sometimes. That was nice, sir. That one, that, that sir was not good. I 
I said it was not good and I missed my combo. A shameful performance from me, guys. Shameful. I'm getting into ground pound territory. Should recovery there now. Surely we didn't try that. Okay. Well, I mean... Wow. I lost the first game. Uh... I don't even know what ELO Snoopy is, though. Because, I mean, he's well on, but every single time... When you get, like, above, like, 2,500... Because I ended 2,600. When you get above, like, 2,500, you start entering, like, the territory where you're just, like, killing pros over and over again, though. So, could be something. But, yeah. Uh, so there you have it. My Ragnar didn't drop a game till I got to Valhalla, and then I dropped one game, then we ran the best of three. So you guys can see that I've really cooked on the Ragnar. And, uh, yeah, we actually got to play every single rank, so it's chill. And, uh, we did this on stream, so if you want to stop by for the next one and try to get in on one of these, you just pull up to the stream at twitch.tv slash Remy. And as always, remember to like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Follow me on Twitter. And, uh, love you guys. See you guys in the next video. Peace.